back again another little month hiatus but it's a special occasion and just a little update so today is the ninth i'm recording this the same day i'm posting this celebrations came out yesterday not only do we have an elite trainer box but we have a pikachu v union which is an insane looking box just look at it i'm not opening that one that one is definitely one that will look better sealed forever because those V-Union cards just look amazing. But this, we are opening. And, and I'm going to at least open all of all of the Celebrations packs from this right now. But because there's a ton of Chase cards. I'll, I'll, the Gyarados, the Dark Gyarados was one of my favorite cards growing up. I have one. I ha still have it. It's sealed away. Um... There's a remake of that that is awesome. Obviously, the Blastoise, the Venus, or the Charizard are big ones. There's a Golden Mew. There's a, there's a bunch of really cool cards. I'm hoping to get any of them. A bunch of variations of Pikachu like cards. A lot of really cool stuff. Hoping to at least get something out of this in terms of that. So I think we'll just start opening it and just kind of see what see see how it goes. So big box here. You know, normally I hate Elite Trainer boxes. I've had. Horrible luck with Elite Trainer boxes in the past, but you got to get at least one of every one that you can because you, they, they get displayed. That's just part of what I do. Um, but this one, I think, looks really clean, looks really nice, and I'm excited to, to get into it here. But let's pull this open here, and it's nice. They're going to have this little booklet here, and I can actually show you those cards I was talking about in this full set here, like... I love a Mew. Look at the Pikachus. And that's not all. So like if we look in here, like even the Ho-Oh right there is a great looking holographic card. Look at all the Pikachus you can get. Another Pikachu, the Mew. But when we flip to these pages, this is when you got the Lugia. That full art professor's research, the Golden Mew. Blastoise, Charizard, Venusaur, the Dark Gyarados, which is the one that I really want. Going over to this side, look at the Birthday Pikachu. That's one of the rarest cards there is. I mean, obviously, it's different. I have this Cleffa, original form. That Shining Magikarp, I also really want. A lot of these EX versions of these Pokemon. The Luxray is a big, big pull. I mean, I could go on and on. There's a ton of really cool stuff. Like... There's just a lot of really cool retro cards from sets that people have loved over the years that they brought back. And they're all within here. And I think this comes... Oh, that's ugly. With... I don't know. Oh, I can just do it that way. Let's, let's see everything that's included here. The biggest thing I want is the celebrations. Let's pull them all out. Get everything out of the box. There's a promo card in here, too. Let's find that. Oh, there that is. And we'll put the rest of this aside. There's nothing, I don't think, special in the rest of that. Seal it back up. Like so. Set him off to the side. Let's take a look at the promo card first. So there we go. A Gold Star Greninja promo card. Well, I mean, it's a Black Star promo, but it's a Gold Star Greninja, as you see up there. Great looking card. And I got to take a look on my own. It's just night the retro feel of this look as opposed to what they look like now. Like I love where Pokemon has gone, but it's like cool to see that. So that's going to be there. Let's see what regular packs we got in this cuz there should be 5 regular packs and then 10 celebrations. Let's see what kind of variety they give us here. So we got a Chilling Rain, a Vivid Voltage, a Darkness Ablaze, Battle Styles, and another Darkness of Blaze. So not a bad selection. Battle Styles I could do without. Even Chilling Rain I didn't have a lot of luck with. But I'm I'm not going to open these. This isn't the, the, the focus of this video. These are the focus of the video. These Celebration Packs. There's only four cards in each pack. We're going to see a lot of duplicates. But there's a chance to pull some really awesome stuff. But in terms of me, in the last month, nothing has really happened. I'm one month away from baby, uh, so everything is going to get crazy. And, and it shows, there's a card as soon as you open it. There is a promo card in the back. I think all of these are holographic, so this Yavelto right away, holographic. And there is code cards for people. 
which I can hand out. And technically there's a card trick, but sometimes the card trick results in you pulling a full art to the front, so I'm not even going to worry about it. I'm just going to go through them. Yveltal. So there's 25 cards in this set, as you see here. The Groudon with the trainers there. Alugia, one of my favorite Pokemon. We get that hollow right off the bat. And on the back of Lunala, so that is technically a bad pack. You'll see what I mean. When you, when you get the nice, like, retro pulls, that's when you're looking at good pack. When you get a full art, that's when you're looking at a good pack. And there's a chance on, the, on those back two to get a full art and one of those retro cards from what I have seen um, people pull. And I don't know if the, the code cards tell anything. Yeah, no, it looks like they're all the white ones. So I'm not going to have to worry about that as much. Code card for y'all. Let's throw these off to the side. Palkia. The Zekrom. No dupe so far. Oh, Lugia. <laughs> Definitely have a dupe now. And on the back, Flying Pikachu V. So there's our first little hit. It's only a V, but it's a good-looking card. Get the Flying Pikachu right there. If we can get all of these in these 10 packs, all the Pikachus... You know, I, I wouldn't be disappointed if we were able to at least do that. So let's see if, we, if we're if we able to do that at least. I want the Gyarados, though. I've said that now several times. That was one of my favorite cards. That is the one that I truly want to get. Oh, there we go. The Ho-Oh Holographic. Good-looking card. Kyogre. So we're actually getting a lot of non-dupes here, which is really... Yes! Blastoise Holographic! Right off the bat, with the third pack. Blastoise was my boy. You can see that, oh, look at that little ripple of like holographic that happens in there. That is awesome. Looks great. And a Mew. That's a good pack for me. That's a good pack for me. Those two cards are two cards that I really, really like the look of that I really wanted to get. Those guys are going to hang out with us. Right off the bat, we get one of the retros. One of the big three, Blastoise. That, that's, that makes me happy. I think from what I've seen, like, the pull rates aren't horrible. Like, it's not going to be an incredibly difficult set, set to fin finish if you were, like, really into it. There's only 25 cards. Obviously, some are more rare than others and harder to get. Um, a no code card here. Groudon again. The Ho Oh again. Let's see what we got in the third slot. Okay, Claydol. This is one of like the little retro guys with the hollow going on there. I'll take that. And the Professor's Research, who's actually working outside of the box here. Drawn over on that side. His notes are just going off the page. I'll take that. Good looking card. I am just. I'm surprised I got the Blastoise off the rip. It wasn't wasn't the Dark Gyarados, but I wasn't expecting to pull a big three that early. Technically, I don't think I was expecting to pull a big three at all. I just kind of... I expected those to be harder to get. Cosmog. I love when there's a trainer. I love when there's that interaction. Groudon again. Lugia again. And on the back... Okay, Solgaleo. Not a duplicate. Once again, trainer on the back. Love to see it. And all of these are hollow. It's really nice. I think what? We're we're half officially halfway through. The Blastoise is our 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 thing to 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 put our cap on right now in terms of pulls. Let's see, we got a hero code card for y'all. And a Kyogre. Now we're getting the dupes. We're going to at some point. Reshiram. Did we already get a Rush Ram? I don't remember. Here comes Team Rocket. Another good, nice retro card. Look at the hollow on the R there. Oh, that can sit in the back with the rest. And another Flying Pikachu. So now we officially have two of those. So one can get sealed up. One can go into the binder. We're not doing too bad here. We're not doing too bad. Haven't got... The one we really want, but I'll have more opportunities. I have other stuff pre-ordered that hasn't came yet. So there will be opportunities to get more of these packs. Xerneas, not a duplicate. Ho-Oh. Ooh, Palkia. 
And on the back, a Flying Pikachu VMAX. So we pulled the regular Flying Pikachu and the VMAX now. Flying a little bit higher, a lot more balloons above the airplanes. Love it. Love it. Good looking card. We'll put him over his friend there. Not doing too bad. Getting some good cards, a new set. Everything is fun. Oh, it feels it feels nice to just have some fun opening something and just kind of looking at all of these new things we got. No card trick. I keep forgetting that. Palkia. Ho-Oh. The Zekrom. Okay, so the Reshiram was new. The Zekrom we had pulled earlier. And the Full Art Pikachu. So there we go. We just got the VMAX Flying Pikachu. And now we get this beautiful Full Art Oh, and the eyes have a hollow in them. That looks so nice. Yeah, I guess you can go behind my head because I know I have a head here and on camera. Oh, we're doing good, guys. This is a happy opening. It's not like I'm opening other stuff and not getting anything. I'm going to get stuff because there's not that much to get. It's going to treat you well. It's going to be nice. Code card. All right, Kyogre again. I think we have another full art back here. Yveltal. Ooh, Ting Magma's Groudon. So another one of those cool, awesome looking retro cards. And you can see the hollow in there on him. And on the back, what full art do we have here? Surfing Pikachu. So we've, we're getting all, I said, I wanted to get all the Pikachu variations. And with one pack left, we've done pretty well at doing that. So here we go, last celebrations one. This might be the only video I do of celebrations because the other stuff I just kind of want to enjoy and open and and I probably wouldn't open them all at once. But for the first opening, you just kind of got to get in, jump, dive head first into it and, and see what you get. Last pack here, Ho-Oh. The Rasharam, and do we get something we want? We do not, Dialga. And a Lunala. So we did not get the Dark Gyarados, the one card we really wanted. But we didn't We didn't do too bad. We got the Greninja promo card, which I was happy about getting. We got this Team Magma's Groudon. We got the Here Comes Team Rocket. You know the big boy Blastoise. I love a good Mew. We got a Mew. We've got Surfing Pikachu. We've got Flying Pikachu VMAX and V. And we got this other beautiful full art Pikachu there with the holographic eyes. So Celebrations, I think, is a great set. There's a lot of things still I, I want to pull. Dark Gyarados. I've said it like eight times. Want to get all of those. I'm excited to open these. Hopefully, I can get more of them. Hopefully... My secret location now allows me to be able to do a little bit more of that. But I'm not sure when the next video will be again. Maybe when uh, Fusion comes out next month, I might do another one. Uh, but that's baby time. That's busy time. I don't know what time I'll have left, but I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Uh, my phone ran out of space, so I didn't really get to finish that video. So I just wanted to take the time to say thank you for watching the video. Uh, I'll be busy. I don't know when the next video is, but... Uh, there will be another one. I, I, I do enjoy coming back once in a while. So uh, thank you for watching. Have a great day.